presenting a lady 56 year female who present with dyspnea class 3 and she is hypertensive on an anechocardiogram four chamber view you see dilated and hypokinetic lv same on a two chamber view you see la and lv dilated with hypokinetic lv of ejection fraction around 28 to 30 percent and uh, uh, if i may tell you this is what i'm going to describe in future that in the when the lv contracts it actually has a longitudinal contraction circumferential contraction and you notice this twist which uh, is uh, like a squeezing a uh, wet towel and this squeeze here i'm going to describe in this patient in a normal patient you take a basal uh, uh, longitudinal uh, circumferential strain apical circumferential strain and then you see the rotation the rotation is this is uh, the apex this is the base the base is moving in this direction while apex is moving in opposite direction producing a squeeze but in this patient if you notice the long uh, the circumferential strain of both things led to there is a movement of the apex and base on the same direction so there is a loss of squeeze why does it happen it happens generally because of the fibrosis so loss of squeeze indicates a severe disease and the fibrosis at the mid level if you have a fibrosis at the mid level of an lv it would not let Uh, the squeeze to happen we call it a rigid body rotation so both apex and base move in the same direction like in our patient this is a bad prognostic sign this indicates a higher risk of hospitalization higher risk of sudden cardiac arrest and higher chance of arrhythmia so you got to be careful about this and